Stephen, 4 0 win. How pleased were you with your team's performance? Yeah, very, very pleasing. You know, the, we, we've, we've had a good bit of form in, in, in the last couple of weeks, which is great. Um, the boys have, are implementing all the things that we've done for the start of the season, which is great. And it starts from the hard work and the dedication and buying into the kind of ideas that we've then that we're, that we're then given them. You can see they're playing with a wee bit of freedom, but their work rate's been terrific. You know, they're desperate to win the ball high up the pitch. Um, they're counter pressing really, really aggressively, which are then allows us then to then when we do land in possession, I think we can still tidy up a wee bit on the turnovers with regards to the decision making at times. We're desperate to score at every opportunity that we win the ball back. But uh, we felt some of the performances were terrific. Mackenzie Cars has been terrific in the last two games, especially whether he's playing as a six or whether he's playing as an eight. He's been absolutely terrific. Um, Adam Brooks playing off the side there as well, something he's not done very often this season. And again, he was absolutely terrific and enjoyed Austin again comes into the side after two really important goals in the game before um, but collectively the, the, the boys are fantastic so we're, we're, we're delighted. After the, the real highs of that derby win and the great experience for your players playing at, yeah. at Celtic Park how important was it that they didn't let the levels drop? It's really important, Jerry. You know, good good teams are, are relentless in everything that they do. Whether that's the way they pass the ball, the way they move, the way they, they, they defend as a unit, um, and that's one thing that, 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 that at first team level that you can see our first team are absolutely relentless since the managers come in in every every aspect. So um, we try and play very similar as people can see. Um, but so you can see that, that we asked them that question: What type of side are we before the game? And and that's 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 the answer we got. You know, it's, but we're not surprised by it because we get lucky enough to train with the boys every single day. We see what they're capable of, and that's the reward, the hard work that you hard work that you get during the week, is the performance on the Saturday or the, in, in, in game day, which is terrific. Another game coming up in a, in a few days yeah. against uh, Broomhill on, yeah. on Saturday. Do, do you sense a kind of a a, a real determination in, in the boys that when they're playing well that the, the goals and the, and the points keep coming? The, the games come thick and fast this season, Jerry. which is, is at this level and at this age that the boys are at in their development, it's really important that, 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 that you live your life properly, you, you look after your body, you then recover really well because your focus is always on the next game. That's always been our priority, it's always been the, the focus has, has, has been on the next game. Because, it, like I said, it's part of the development, getting used to playing Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Wednesday, because that's what you need to do if, do if you want to become a Celtic player. You must be prepared to put your body um, through some real pain just to get the performance that, that, that the fans, the supporters, the staff and your teammates then deserve. So um, they do that. And again, the, the, the game on Saturday against Open Goal is going to be a really, really difficult game. They're a good side, lots of very good players. They're well coached, they're well drilled. So it's one that, that, that we'll go to uh, full of confidence as, as we always do.